Catalonia, where just weeks ahead of the regional elections, polls show that pro-independence parties might fail to retain an absolute majority in the parliament. Now, the poll shows pro-independence parties winning as many as 67 seats, one short of the absolute majority that they would need to retain control of the regional parliament. Now, Catalan separatist leaders are predicted to win about 46% of the votes, which is almost one person down from the 2015 elections. Meanwhile, Catalonia's former leader, Carlos Puigdemont, has kicked off his campaign from Belgium, kick-starting his campaign. Puigdemont said, and I quote, we, the Catalans, demonstrated to the world that we have the capacity and the will to become an independent state. And on the 21st of December, we must ratify this, unquote. This is what has been said by Carlos Puigdemont about the elections that are slated on the 21st of December. Now, the Catalan region is holding its parliamentary elections on the 21st of December after Spanish Prime Minister Mariano Rojoy last month triggered Article 155 of the Spanish Constitution and thereby dissolved the Catalonian Autonomous Parliament and also fired the leader of Catalonia, Carlos Puigdemont, for his role in the independence referendum, following which Puigdemont had to flee to Belgium and he now faces charges of rebellion and sedition.